My name is Never Chris, and this is my review for Metal Slug Anthology from the Nintendo Wii. This is a compilation of the first six Metal Slug games. I'll admit it, as a child growing up, I had a personal vendetta against the Neo Geo. How dare a system come out of nowhere and expect me to pay $600 for it while only hosting video games made by exactly one company. It was insane and it didn't help that the only person that I knew who owned the system was a stuck up spoiled rotten kid whose whore of a mother hated me for some reason. So yeah, as the Metal Slug series was mostly Neo Geo exclusive for a very long time, I kinda skipped over them. I was familiar with the name and I might have played them a couple times in the arcade, but that was about it. Bitter feelings from a depressing childhood aside, each and every Metal Slug is pretty much the same game with a different gloss of paint, played out in the same style as Contra. The series uses impressive artwork to give the perfect clash between hardcore action and just the right amount of cheese to remind you not to take the game so seriously. But on average, the games are laid out wonderfully. When you die, it isn't the game's fault. It's because you weren't good enough. You can definitely get better, but you're going to have to work hard at it. Very hard. Many side-scrolling action fans consider these games to be excellent classics and it isn't difficult to see why. Yes, the visuals are old school, but they have a charm or personality that keeps them from aging poorly like many other games. Each game visits a new variety of locations. The action is intense and gaining new vehicles to plow over enemies is exciting and thrilling. The Metal Slug games are games you don't play just to beat, but instead play to improve your abilities. You could probably marathon the entire series in a single night if you were compelled enough, but the real joy comes from trying a level for the first time, getting your ass completely handed to you, and then slowly realizing that the particular level can indeed be conquered as you gain the proper skills. This style of Twitch action gameplay isn't for everyone, but for those who do enjoy it, this collection will be like a holy grail of entertainment. Just be sure to take these games one at a time, and remember that these titles were originally released years apart from each other, giving fans of the originals time to truly experience each game individually while taking a breather before diving into the next. Very sadly, Metal Slug Anthology for the Nintendo Wii fails to become the ultimate addition to own of these games. While the emulation is mostly perfect, Terminal Reality, the developer who handled putting together this collection, completely botched the controls. As old school games, the ideal way to play these games is to forget the variety of Wii Mote controls and grab a regular controller. First off, the Nintendo Wii Classic controller is not supported. It's possible that this was because the game was released before third parties realized that the Classic controller was available for non-virtual console games, but it's still disappointing. The real kick in the balls though is that while the GameCube controller is supported, the D-pad is not. You're stuck with an analog stick and there's absolutely no excuse for it. This is a smack in the head oversight to the highest degree, and also rather sad. Metal Slug Anthology is still very playable with the cube analog stick, and it doesn't completely ruin the games or anything like that, but it is what brings this anthology down from an excellent release worth archiving to merely cool to check out. While these games are excellent and very enjoyable, when I still prefer to play pirated emulated versions on the PC using an arcade stick, there's a definite problem. However, if this is your only method for checking these games out, then I fully recommend it, and I can guarantee that if you're into this kind of stuff, you'll surely enjoy it. Metal Slug Anthology for the Nintendo Wii gets a 7 out of 10.